Hey there, Michael Griffiths here, founder of Referral Marketing Guru. Sales is hard only when you don't have warm, qualified prospects coming into your pipeline. That's when sales is hard. Otherwise, sales isn't hard at all. See, people who can't make sales, when you look at it, simply don't have enough people to sell to. If getting clients is hard, it's simply because you don't have enough people to sell to. So I always go, rather than focusing on fixing the sales aspect, and sure, your language or your presentation or what you say, it might need to be improved. But you won't really know unless you have lots of sales opportunities. And for most people, they just simply don't. Okay, where you think most coaches, consultants, professional service oriented businesses, they're lucky if they have two, three, maybe up to five sales conversations a week, if they're lucky. For a lot of them, that's actually a month. Well, imagine if you had that every day. And that's not hard to do when you've got warm, qualified prospects coming into your pipeline every day. So where did this start? I saw a post on, on a group that I'm a part of. And they, the person just simply asked, who gets three to four warm leads a month? But yeah, fair enough. So that sort of intrigued me to see the comments because there were like 17 comments underneath it. And there was this one person that stood out and I said, oh, I pity if I was a client of yours. Their mindset just blew me away. As they said, well, who would need three or four a month? If you converted it 50, 60%, well, I couldn't take any more than one client a month anyway. That's like 12 clients a year. That would be the best thing ever. And that's fine. That's not, there's not a problem with that. It was the language that was being used that made me just simply go, you're not a business. All you are wanting to do is just have a glorified job where no one else tells you what to do. You're the boss. But you have to constantly do everything yourself simply because of your thinking. So that got me going and then I just wrote a simple response. I mean, really the number doesn't matter. Whether you want three or four a day, whether you want three or four a week, whether you want three or four a month. Anything is really easy when you focus above that. So do you want, uh, who gets three to four warm qualified leads a day? Great. It's about how. How do you consistently build an audience, bring in warm qualified prospects, educate them so that then they're jumping up saying, yes, I would like a solution, please. How can you help me, please? That's when sales becomes easy. That's the goal that every single business should be aiming for. You should have a waiting list. You should be able to increase fees whenever you want to and no one will drop off simply because you've got too many people. Sales, marketing, business growth, all of it is simply mindset. If you don't know what you don't know, it's really hard to grow. When you're around people who do consistent $10,000 days, $100,000 weeks, million dollar months, and you start to look at how they think, all of a sudden, whether you want to do that or not is irrelevant. It changes your thinking and all of a sudden you start to realize how important it is to be concentrating on where are my warm qualified leads that I've got the ability to sell to. Not picking on anything in particular here. But if going to networking events, handing out business cards, hoping that one person that might be there is ready to buy, is that bringing in warm, qualified prospects into your pipeline every single day? No, it simply isn't. If putting up a blog 
or a piece of social content. Is that bringing in warm, qualified prospects every single day? Probably not, because it's more educating them. So you've got to understand what are the things that you could do that brings in warm, qualified prospects, that makes it much easier for you, that ensures that sales isn't hard. And that's why when we talk about building out that million dollar referral system, it's about having channels that fill your CRM, that allows you to educate and turn people from being cold to hot, that then gets the hot people raising their hands and saying, yes, I'd like help, please. Every week, at the end of the week, we ask our partnership club guys, hey, what's your win for the week? Last week, it was just consistently two new clients, three new clients, three new clients, two new clients, two more making a decision over the weekend. Like That's what it should be. Having five, six sales calls a week isn't hard, but it makes a big difference. If you think, Three sales a month, 30 new, 36 new clients a year. That's what we do in our implementation plan. That's our promise. Eight and a half sales a month. 100 plus clients a year. That's what we do in Partnership Club. So you've got to break things down so that you know how many sales calls you're having and therefore what your number is that you need to reach each week so you know how many warm, qualified prospects you need to be bringing in each day. Hopefully that's a bit of insight, helpful, get you thinking. But it's time to be a business owner that thinks about their numbers rather than just simply, hey, whatever comes in, comes in, and if they buy, they buy, and it, it's all a bunch of luck. We don't want luck. We want structure, system, process, so that you get consistency in the result. Hey, remember, come join us. If you're not part of our Million Dollar Referral Network free Facebook group, come grab the Nine Accelerator Training. Come hang out each day where we teach people how to get more referrals, grow their networks, use partnerships, so they're getting a consistent, warm, qualified leads every single day. Till next time, guys. Take care. Speak to you real soon. See you later all.